What's up YouTube, it's your girl Tatiana B and I am back with another dope video. Today I am super duper excited to talk to you guys about how my student was able to generate $2,300 in sales in one day. We're gonna be diving into her marketing plan, what we did, what I taught her, and how she actually made this money. And I thought it was really cool to dissect her brand as I've always dissected other big brands, but why not dissect a brand that I literally have like created with a student um, and show you guys how you can also do the same, okay? So go ahead and subscribe to this channel, like this video. Now before I get into any crazy details with you guys about what I'm gonna be teaching, I wanna get the important stuff out the way. I have two major announcements for you guys. First, because I know you guys are gonna be asking, one-on-one -on -one mentorship is available. I will have that link down below for you guys. I am taking on students for one-on-one -on -one mentorship the same way that I actually built this girl's brand with her. I'm gonna show you guys and we'll be doing the same if you are interested. The link will be linked down below for inquiry forms. All you do is inquire and then we will take it from there. I'll email you back. Um, second thing guys is I am no longer going to be teaching putting out teaching content on this channel. My teaching content will be moving to a new channel. I am going to make this channel just my personal life, um, vlogging, beauty, makeup, clothing hauls, everything like that will be placed on this channel. And I am going to be moving my new teaching content to my new channel called Let Tatiana Teach You. That is going to be where everything teaching goes down. That will also be linked down below. So show some love and support and subscribe to that channel as well, guys. If you like me and you wanna know more about me, then you can stick around on this channel, but just know that there will be no more teaching content after this video put on this channel. I will be bashing out a lot of teaching content still. It just will be on another channel, okay guys? So let's go ahead and dive straight into this video. So I have a student by the name of Hawa that reached out to me to work. We started working in like mid-July, August, beginning of August. Um, she actually lives in Atlanta. So shout out to Hawa. I'm gonna be talking about her brand today called H Lux Collections. H Lux Collections is a premium raw hairline that sells wigs and many different other things that you guys can actually go check out and shop with. They are live and we're gonna dive into how they actually opened up and everything. So how I reached out to me doing our inquiry form, just like I have told you guys, and she reached out needing mentorship to actually launch her brand. When she reached out to me, she did not have um, a website yet, any photo shoots or anything like that. She did have her vendor though. How I did have her vendor and I was able to come in and work with her on her marketing strategy for actually releasing the brand. When we first started getting together, um, we were focused a lot on giving her a launch photo shoot to be able to actually put out the brand because how I was ready. She just didn't know how to piece everything together. I'm not gonna lie, she was super duper ready. So when I started working with her, one of the things that you guys can know first is she had a vendor. She had already tested out her vendor. I believe that how I had a logo already created. Um, she had her social media page already created. She was not posting on there, but it was already up. She had been talking about her brand a little bit on her social media page, but she had never released anything or like, you know, said what day it was coming. So she wanted us to work together on her marketing strategy for launching the brand. So when we started to work together, we worked immediately on, I taught her a couple things obviously in mentorship that I wouldn't teach anybody, just what a sales funnel is, branding, make sure your branding is together, logos, everything like that. But we aggressively started working on her marketing strategy, including her photo shoot. How I didn't really have an idea for a photo shoot when she came to me, and so I was even able to come up with an idea on a brainstorm call with her regarding her photo shoot. We decided that we would do two concepts for her actual launch strategy. And so one thing that you guys can take away from having a successful brand is that regardless if you're in the hair industry or not, you're going to need multiple pieces of content. So that's something that we heavily focused on initially was putting out a lot of content for this brand. And so we initially said we're gonna get videos created. And I think we got about like three to four different types of videos created. We spoke about actually having two different concepts of photo shoots, one that is fun, one that is more 
um, standard and basic for the actual website. Because if you guys know anything, you're going to want to have your basic shootout, your headshots and things of that nature already put out onto your website. So it'll be easier for you to just go ahead and market at your brand and people can see your product immediately. So after we did a little brainstorming, um, on her actual shoot. We scheduled a date for it and we were shooting in Atlanta and I actually was able to come on set, which I did a vlog about that on my channel where I went on set with her and showed you guys her shoot. A major key factor that I always stress to any of my students or anybody on YouTube in general is if you're going to have a hair brand, you wanna make sure that your hair shoots have a lot of hair in the shoot. And that's something I wanna say that how I did very well. Because when it comes down to marketing your brand um, and people don't know about your company, it's the first time they're seeing your company, they wanna see texture, they wanna see hair, they wanna see volume. And so when we did the shoot, it was stressed that, hey, this hair needs to be full. She got long pieces of hair, she got models, and she worked with the best people to bring her idea to life. Working with high quality photographers, high quality videographers, and making sure that the people that you work with understand the type of quality of the work that you need to put out is very, very important. Especially in an industry where you sell beauty, you sell lifestyle, you sell enhancements. You need to make sure that the quality of the work that you are putting out resembles the life or the product that you want to portray so after we actually did the shoot um, we did a couple reels and I think that those really helped but a really cool thing that we brainstormed together was her actual visual and I'm gonna put a clip of the visual up for you guys to see this was like her teaser visual and we brainstormed this one so go ahead and watch it first <laughs> H looks dropping. Everybody keeps asking about my hair. Mm. What you working with? Uh, what you Hello, girl. My bad. What you working with? Shh. What you working with? Uh, what you working with? And the reason that this visual was so so good is because it created anticipation for when this brand was about to launch. How ah uh, how ah? Uh, when's H Lux dropping? Hmm, and then she did a little snippet of the actual visual that was going on. All of that created anticipation for her marketing strategy on social media. And I wanna talk about something that how I did really good that I see a lot of students don't do as much that I think really helped her brand generate so much revenue is that she actually went forward and was talking about the brand on her actual personal page a lot. She constantly said that her brand was coming soon before it was even coming soon or we had a launch date. She constantly was talking about the fact that you guys want to follow my page, subscribe, do, 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 do. Talking about your brand is really, really important before launching, even on your personal page. If you know that your face is going to be anywhere in your brand, go ahead and talk about it on your page because the people that like you or see your hair, they're going to go and follow you and actually support your brand at the end of the day. So after we had the shoot, another cool thing that we did during this actual launch strategy for Hawa was that we created an SMS list and started building a lot of anticipation for her SMS list. She was able to literally acquire, I think, over 100 people on that SMS list that were actually eager to shop with her. So if you want to know or be the first to know when we launch, subscribe to our SMS list. A teaser that I'm going to tell you guys is the app that we use was called Postscript. That is on Shopify.com and their app store. Postscript is an SMS messaging app that allows you to create keywords and they give you a phone number. They give you like text launch to this number to be the first to know when we launch. So that is something that we focused on a lot, actually promoting her SMS list before actually launching, making sure that people that are interested in seeing the hair and wanting to shop this hair subscribes to the list. So they will be the first to know once she actually launched. And I think actually focusing on building a list is so, so important because the day you launch, everybody that's seen the hair prior to, they might not like put your launch date in on their calendar. But if you can directly SMS message them, let them know beforehand, we're launching in an hour, we're launching the day before, you can guarantee that people are aware of the fact that you are going to be launching. And that's something that we really, really focused on a lot was her SMS list. Now, another thing that we did when we actually launched this brand was that we focused on using high quality hairstylists as well. I mentioned this using a good team, but making sure that you get really good content when it comes down to like actual hair tutorials. I did. Make 
make Hawa go get her hair done multiple times in Atlanta as well from good hairstylists just to create a lot of content about the brand. You need to make sure that when you're actually about to launch a brand, you are posting consistently, providing different pieces of content. Especially if we talk hair, you want multiple people to shop with different types of products that you're gonna have. So go ahead, get your hair done multiple different times and get visual content. I used to stress to her to actually film unboxings when she finally did launch. I stress transformation visuals as well when you're actually getting your hair done. Film a lot of content. I told her prior to, at the before the photo shoot, make sure that you get visuals of, or videos of the hair that the models are gonna have in and you're gonna have in. And one of her videos that she posted on H Love Collections page on Instagram actually did extremely well because obviously the hair looked really good. And so coming out the gate with her first post, it was a banger. And so you need to think about every time that you post on social media, it is almost your first impression that people are going to be meeting you and they're going to be seeing you for the first time. So at that moment, when they seen the hair, they already fell in love with it. Now these people are wanting to know when you launch. Okay, perfect subscribe to our SMS list, right? So another thing that we really did really well was we strategized, and this is something that I do offer in my mentorship course as well, we strategized her posting schedule. So we created a content calendar of what would be posted following up to the day that she launches. We were very strategic with what posts go when, what day, what the captions would say, if any influencer posts would be involved. We spoke about using influencers as well, but we really scheduled out what type of content would be created and posted on that platform so we plotted out even with the graphic designer what type of graphics would be posted on her page as well prior to and all of these things just made sure that she stayed in her audience's face multiple multiple times during this time making sure that the people see her and it's honestly everything that I teach you guys or tell you guys on YouTube all those and there's things that obviously I don't tell you guys that I keep for my mentorship but those strategies are the same ones that we use have a schedule plan for what you're gonna post. Make sure that you have a wow factor with the visuals that you post or different things like that. Create wow factors for what you're going to be promoting and marketing during this time. You wanna think about that as well. So we had our wow factor with her visual, her influencers that she also used obviously brought awareness to her brand as well. And another thing that we really stressed here in her brand was her branding. She got amazing packaging. All of her branding was together, thank you cards, different things like that I provided her with the packaging vendor and she was able to go ahead and get tags for her brand and all these different things but one of the things that I really want to highlight obviously how I did do $2,300 in a day and that is amazing for launching a new hair brand but one of the things I want to highlight is everything that I told her in all reality we did a monthly mentorship we did two weeks at first and then she came back and we did two more weeks and we did ended up doing a month but one of the things that I really want to highlight here is that everything that I told her her to do for her brand she did it and she understood that investing into your brand will get you the results that you're looking for so i hope you guys enjoyed this segment of the um dissecting my students brand um i just really am super duper proud of her and i wanted to show you guys an actual true testimonial of a student and she i'll leave a testimonial up for you guys where she texts me about her results and everything like that but just actually showing a student that has done extremely well and to motivate you guys to show you that you can launch a brand and be successful so if you are interested in my mentorship it will be linked down below for all of you guys i am accepting students i'll possibly be doing a waiting list if it comes too much but it is going to be available and remember that i'm moving all of my teaching content to another youtube channel go ahead and comment and subscribe to that channel and like this video and comment down below if you enjoyed it as always stay beautiful and blessed and i will see you guys in another video